Max. Prove yourself. Okay, the tank on the arrow. I like that. Very nice, very nice indeed. Stinger coming in, beating away at them. They're going to be able to find the pullback. They've got a damage here as well from Chessie and another round of axes, but old Stinger's dead for it as well, and they're blocking out those camps while that's happening. Top lane. Maybe some action of Bruin as they've been able to find that Beastmaster yet again, and the Jingu stacks are up for Chessie. He finds another kill. Uh -oh. Beast, oh, God, Limp. Pavita walking forward, wants to find this kill. He jumps forward for more. The oh. raise, though, we're trying to outplay him. Oh. The outplay is there. Oh, Limp. Field accidentally draws the aggro of that range creep. They do find a stomp onto Old Stinger yet again. That extra He's range dead. from the Monkey King. Got him caught. Oh. Got him killed. As the tree plant is not going to be enough. And Chessie finds a for it. But over here by the shrine, Kyle has gone in deep now. Is he going to end up being punished for this one? They bring in Excel as well. There's going to be the net. They've got a kinetic field if they need to. Kyle's gone. Infamous get on the board there. Definitely. Level 5, though, those nerfs are no longer relevant. And Kyle going to be caught. Arrow is there. Does get punished and killed off. Yep. They have enough for it. Those deaths, at least to a large extent, feel like they have purpose. It was going to be a little bit less purpose if the Shadow Fiend goes down right now. His limp completely surrounded. He's dead. Yep. That is a big kill. Tried to go for the courier snipe. What was happening? Not going to happen. Now a follow-up. Oh, he almost thought about going for the ensnare there. I don't think it will actually stop the courier. The animation will, will be on him, and he'll yeah. just like keep flying away. Jesse chasing yet again, and on a killing spree. Monkey King. No. Infamous. They go on to Z-Freak yet again. Doppelganger turning, trying to take him down. And, well, the stun does land. Skullfield maybe going to be punished for that one. They take down the Rubik. The Shadow Fiend farmed up and, and Monkey King had farmed up. They really needed to have a better laning stage than okay. they got. And Stinger, again, you talk about it. It's just been a really rough go for him. They are going to Moonlight Shadow. And on the other side of it, Moo's able to get the kill on the Skullfield. Kataro dropping somewhat low as well, so they trade off kills there. Stinger after the Marana ulti. Still trying to farm here in the jungle as Pepita takes down Z. For we need to watch for is actually old Chessy going to be pulled back in. The glimpse is there. They try and bring him down. Kyle does have a stomp to turn this. He's going to have a boundless strike up if he wants to use Ooh. it. Get some regen from that one, but a good doppelganger from Kataro. Keeps him alive. The DD now chasing onto Kyle. Infamous looking for a catch, and it looks like they're going to be able to find that kill. Dominating for Pepita. Infamous the world? How, how, how bad is that? Schofield going to get found here. And most likely killed off. The difference would be, like, looks like we're going to see drums first. Okay. Oh, Pepita finds Kyle again, trying to run him down. This Haster and doing work, going to go for the stomp, cancels uh -oh. it, and now going to try and walk away, but is just going to be pummeled to death by Pepita on a mega kill streak here. Strong enough, they just group up as five and take this mid tier one tower. Uh, oh, static storm down. They are going to try and turn this Chessie very low and is going to end up falling. Move back in away. They are able to take down the kill onto the Beastmaster. Maybe Kataro will end up dropping low as well. The stomp is there. It connects onto one. They had the glimpse that was stolen and they pull back in Kataro. A double kill for Limp. Well, why? That's super important. But uh, Stinger? He's going to get brought down by the Firestorm. I mean, that looks really bad because we have the full vision of everything. But yeah, just walking into a couple of heroes. And now Kataro also going to be found. They. Throw out a Firestorm, going to try and force back the Illusions and push down another tower. Meanwhile, in the Radiant Jungle, it looks like there's another battle breaking out. They found Kyle. The That's arrow's going to connect. <laughs> but That's not a Kyle. here, too. Requiem. They're yeah. thinking about it. He's back in. And he is going to be glimpsed. There's a Static Storm drop down. Limp pops the Requiem. That's going to force back Schofield. Might be able to find the kill, and they are going to be able to get it. The Dark Earth down to the bottom lane. Roche and then walks away. Schofield spots him. The stomp is not going to be used as the root is there, and they get the kill. I mean, there is a point where you cross. Dodge the arrow and still living through this. The kinetic field is now down, and it looks like this fight has gone terribly for Infamous. They're trying to run away. Are they going to be able to actually get out of here, though? Complexity thinking about just taking this fight. Kyle moves in as well, and they're able to force Infamous back. Chessie chasing. Gets the slowdown onto a cell. He's going to use the glimpse, but... 
Just pulls him back to the tower quicker. Okay. Are they going to try to kill him again? I mean, he's going to keep going for this one. The Rubik is now showing up. Requiem of Souls doppelganger away upon. Kataro still thinking about chasing, but they get the lift. They get the catch. They're going to probably find that kill on Excel. Ended up dropping the ulti. Might be able to find the kill on a Shadow Feed. He's walking out of there. Isn't oh. enough. They are going to be able to get him. Well played. It's Yo, who's only a couple thousand behind the Shadow Feed. Yep. Oh, over here in the jungle, though. They did find Chessie. Pepita picking up a big kill. They're trying to chase here. Z-Freak coming in. Skullfield's still in the area. And Pepita leaping away. They have some amount of vision, though. And trying to run around. The dust wears off. And over on the other side, the Static Storm is down. It's on to two of them. Do they have any extra follow-up damage? Kataro's here. They're able to pull them apart. Kyle goes down. Mu trying to do it as well. They do kill off that Marana. But on the other side, it's Skull. He's going to be found. The Meteor Hammer, it's going to be a four staff away. Chessie goes in, connects with two, onto the Boundless Strike, and the arrow's going to connect as well. They take him down so quickly. Did you see Moonlight Shadow now moving in? They spot Mu. Oh, everybody is in the Roche pit, and they're going to get Z Freak right at the start of this one. Can they come back and contest and fight around Roche? It's not all the way down. 70 second cooldown. Will be an opportunity to do stuff soon, Lim. Pulled back in. They have the connect field, but not enough mana for the Static Storm. He gets the BKB off, turns to fight. Requiem, it's going to be Taj, but Lim is down to such low HP now. They get oh. the turn around. Look at that damage. Pepita's dead. They lift up the Naga Siren as well, and she can get the song off. They're all grouped up together. They still have Static Storm, but it's too slow. Well, 10, 15 minutes ago when I said that, once you get... Oh, just walk back into it. I think he was trying to net him. He knew that he was going to be chased regardless with Shadow Fiend wrapping. Okay. Yeah, I said that, you know, once Lim gets this BKB, he's practically immortal because there's not enough damage. But as we saw from the previous engagement, both PL and Murana are starting to hit pretty hard. Jesse finds Excel. They missed the Boundless Strike. The does not really matter, though. Another BKB charge used by Chess. But Kataro is still on the other side of all of this. And... Limp trying to burst through it. He's getting the mana drained. The roar onto one. Chessie left all alone. He dies. Now Kataro wanting to chase Limp. If they can get within range and slow him down enough, they might be able to burn through the Aegis. Mu is there. They see him on the high ground. Now trying to drain his mana as well. Doesn't have almost anything left in the tank. And Kataro going to go for the doppelganger away. He does not get hit there by the sleep. Schofield and Marana, they've also shown up. They take down another. Complexity trying to get me trapped here. He does not have his ultimate to get out of this one. Yeah, so that's going to be another easy pickoff. Um, Kataro, yeah, he is uh, starting to really hit hard, as you were mentioning. Yeah. I think unintentional. That was telepathic. <laughs> that was that was something. No, there was actually a hawk up there, so they might have realized oh. it, but it does not matter. He goes down quickly, and Chessie upset about the situation previously. Right at the start, and now starting to burn through that mana. Over on the other side, Chessie looking to the opening. Static Storm down. They're able to get away from it, though. Meteor Hammer, it's off the mark as well. Pepita trying to deal the damage. They roar up the Shadow Fiend to keep him control for the moment. And now the song is down. Do they have anything to follow it? Limp gets everything drained from him. He doesn't get off the Requiem. He is going to pop. That's just the Death Requiem. And now able to get the Doppelganger away again. The damage is there. Schofield's gone, but they're losing everybody on Complexity. Chessie might be too much to deal with, though, as well, muted for the moment. And... Trying to bring him down. They're starting to burn through the mana. Chessie gets the cheese off. Able to live. Infamous Kataro starting to fall. And Chessie still ends up going down. That was three lives almost, it felt like. And Excel gets the kill on the ET. Z Freak's gone. Oh. They take them all down. Z Freak actually turned. Lens steal. You can get a ton of illusions. Star Storm steal. Kyle's dead. Now Kyle. They have the doppelganger. And a broken Kyle falls. Send out a Hawk as well, getting some good vision here. This is not spotted right now by Complexity. The Root is there. They get the Sleep now onto three. This is really big. If they can lay down the right Stack Storm, it's an Axe upgraded one as well. They're going to focus down the Shadow Fiend. Nowhere left to go. He's muted. They're waiting to go in right now with Kataro, but they're able to turn it back around. Complexity make the beautiful play. Rubik making work of it as well as they turn this back around. Take down Kataro. A triple kill for Chessie.